We finally have some of our first extended looks and reviews for Rise of the Ronin, and if you were already on the fence about picking this one up, these reviews certainly didn't help. But after watching the reviews, here are some of my big takeaways. The combat, no surprise, is gonna be good. Maybe not great, but really, really good. Not quite as difficult as Neo 2 or Sekiro, something more closely related to a Ghost of Tsushima, which is totally fine. The combat in Ghost of Tsushima was a lot more approachable for people and was still challenging enough to keep it interesting throughout, but the graphics and the overall open world yeah, those are going to be bad. Certainly not anything like what we'd expect from a next-gen PS5 exclusive. I think Cowboy even compared it to a PS3 game, which is harsh but fair. Now these reviews were only based on the first 3 or 4 hours of the game, so it is entirely possible that the game completely opens up in the mid to later stages. We'll just have to wait and see. But what stood out to you, and how do you feel about the release of Rise of the Ronin? Let me know in the comments.